Hello everybody, it is I, Sakamoto, back at it again with another episode of, you guessed it, it's Undertale. Oh wow, a surprise surprised at this point, right? Ha ha ha, I'm so funny, ha ha ha, funny guy. What the hey? I'm not going there yet. I want to talk to these guys first. Sorry, Undyne, like, told us there was totally human in the area. So like, us royal guards are blocking off the elevators around. Yeah. Even if the elevators aren't working anyway, we'll do our best, Miss Undyne. Okay. So I guess we're gonna go in here. Oh no, what is that? Well, that explains the cameras, I think. It's you? Yeah, I know, that's what I'm saying. It's too dark to near the... It's too dark to see near the walls. Okay. Oh, my god. I didn't expect you to show up so soon. I haven't showered, I'm barely dressed, and it's all messy, and... Um... Uh, hiya! I'm Dr. Alphys. I'm Asgore's Royal Scientist. But, 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 uh, I'm not one of the bad guys. Actually, since you stepped out of the ruins, I've, um, been observing your journey through my console. Your fights. Your friendships, everything. I was originally going to stop you, but watching someone on the screen really makes you root for them. So, uh, now I want to help you. Using my knowledge, I can easily guide you through Hotland. I know a way right to Asgore's castle, no problem. Well, actually, um, there's just a tiny issue. A long time ago, I made a robot named Metaton. Uh, originally, I built him to be an entertainment robot. Uh, you know, like a robotic TV star or something. Anyway, recently I decided to make it more useful. You know, just some practical stuff. Just some small practical adjustments, like, um, anti-human anti combat features? Uh, of course, when I saw you coming, I immediately decided I have to remove those features. Unfortunately, I have made a teensy mistake while doing so. And, um, now he's an unstoppable killing machine with a thirst for human blood? <laughs> but, um, hopefully we won't run into him. Question mark. Did you hear something? Oh no! Oh, yes! Welcome, beauties! Welcome, beauties, to today's quiz show. Sorry, I should have done robot from the start. Oh boy, I can already tell it's gonna be a great show. Everyone, give a big hand for our wonderful contestant. Never played before, gorgeous. No problem, it's simple. There's only one rule answer correctly. Or you die. Had a ton of attacks. Cry. Screaming is against the screaming is against the rules. Let's start with an easy one. What's the prize for answering correctly? No questions. Right, sounds like you get it. The quiz show continues. His metal body renders him invulnerable to attack. Here's your terrific prize. What's the king's full name? Correct, what a terrific answer. Enough about you, let's talk about me. What are robots made of? Too easy for you, huh? Here's another easy one for you. Oh god. Wrong, wrong, wrong. Uh, cool, I'm glad I bought those. Don't count on your victory. How many fly, flies are in this jar? Completely, utterly wrong. 
Wait, you took less health that time. Wait, I'm never getting the monsters this. That is Froggit. Oh my goodness. But can you get this one? Would you switch a ghost? Great answer, I love it. That's the only one available. Oh, what do I do? Here's a simple one. How many letters are the name of Okay. I was just guessing that. I mean, I guess on the fly one and the really weird, long, convoluted one, but time to break out the big guns. In the dating simulation, we need to get min mu mu Okay. It's ice cream? I, I'm not reading this, I'm sorry, it's going too fast. I mean, I could read it, but I just having to do the voice. Alphys, 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 you aren't helping our contestant, are you? Oh, you should have told me. I'll ask you a question. You'll be sure to know the answer to. What is up? Dr. Alphys, have a crush on. Seriously? My, my, how conceited can you get? I love it. And while you are completely wrong, you deserve some credit. I've seen her watch you on her computer screen, smiling when you succeed, shrieking when you fail, and always, always whispering, no, wrong, you have to go that way. It is, in its own way, it is not love. Oh, well, well, the doctor elf is helping you. The show has no dramatic tension. It can't go on like this, but, but, this was just a pilot episode. Next time, more drama, more romance, more bloodshed. Until next time, darlings. Well, we survived the quiz show. What? Well, that was certainly something. It's it's a bag of dog food. It's half full. Wait, wait. Oh, you're not a robot. Sorry. Wait, wait. Let me give you my phone number. That then maybe if you need help, I could. Where did you get that phone? It's ancient. It doesn't even have texting. Wait a second, please. I was doing the robot accent again, I'm sorry. But in her voice for a second. <laughs> Here, I upgraded it for you. I can do texting. I can do... It can do texting items. It's got a keychain. I even signed you up for the Overground number one social network. Now we're officially friends. <laughs> Going to the bathroom. I've heard this filled with instant noodles and soda. Sure. It's a beat up figurine of a female human with cat ears. The computer, it's actually some kind of puzzle inside it. Seems like the notes to something, but it's all written in chicken scratch. It seems like a walkthrough to a game or garbage can, but it's pretty cute. The space behind the wall is only a few feet wide. This bathroom tank. No feet are tapping just behind the door. Wait, I didn't want to go this way. Okay. Scientific books. They seem very dusty. All these books are labeled human history. Read one. You look inside a book. It's a comic of a giant robot fighting a beautiful alien princess. This doesn't strike you as very accurate. VHSs and DVDs are various cartoons. They're all labeled human history. All these, okay. Look inside. It's a comic book. Two scantily clad chefs are flinging energy pancakes at each other. This doesn't strike you as very accurate. More human history. You look inside a book, it's a comic book. A hideous android is running to school with toast in its mouth. Seems like it's late. This doesn't strike you as very accurate. Pink goop drips from this strange machine. I wanna watch an I've been I wanna watch some anime. Pink goop drips from this strange machine. Looks like Elphus's work table seems dusty. The wardrobe is full of dirty lab coats and a single clean dress. There are letters from many monsters here. Froggit, Snowy, Doggo. They're all unopened. It's a lamp with pink fish on the lampshade. There's no light bulb. An incredible invention. When not used, this bed folds into an extremely easy to draw box. Beautiful. It's a promo poster from Meta Ten's TV premiere. On the flap it says, thank you for making my dreams come true. I'm wanting to call him Metatron because of Supernatural. Which is 
my favorite TV show of all time, by the way. I haven't watched the Winchesters yet, so don't spoil it for me, please. Like, I haven't even seen the first episode. Whoa! Alpha's updated status. Just realized I didn't watch Undying Pike the Human. Hold on, I didn't save. Can I go back? Uh, I also want to see. Okay. That's pretty much my diet. Instant noodles and like pepperoni to put in them and like um sometimes I'll have either really cheap ham and cheese sandwiches or like I'll, I'll be able to make really cheap chili dogs. That's been my diet lately most of the time. <laughs> Yay. Don't feel bad though. I mean, it's better than, you know, some people in the world get, I suppose. Feel bad for them instead. Well, I know she's unbeatable. I'll ask her about it later. For now, I gotta call up the human. For now, I gotta call up the human guy then. Kitty face. I think that was kitty face. Oh, this song is really good. We'll just sit and listen to it for a second. I'm trying to drink my soda, Vulcan. Hi. Ah, pretty much that's all. Ah, Joe, Kofi! That's the voice I should have given Timmy's. Alright. Gonna call him in a minute. Not if I call you first. Uh, oh my goodness. I can access the dimensional box. I think that's because of Dr. Alfie's. That's pretty convenient. That means I can buy a shitload of items and carry them around with me everywhere. What did that say? The whooshing sound of steam and cogs. It fills you with determination. I hate using the phone. I don't want to do this. Help me out. Soon they're at plane. Soon they're playing. Gets in the way. Not on purpose or anything. Oh boy. Approach. You get closer to soon they're playing, but not too close. Eh? Human? They're playing take this nose dismissively. I, I want to see what happens when you pick flirt. It has a powerful rudder. Huh? You sicko! Blushy face. Oh, shit. Alright, I'm out of here. That's, it was gonna say something, but oh well. Oh, that's an exit. So cool. Oh my god, I, I've had my claw over the last digit for five minutes. Oh my god, I'm just gonna do it, I'm just gonna call! Click. Whoever was calling hung about before you answered it. Alright. Let's go check out what's to the right real quick, if we can. Um, yeah. We can get back, I think. Okay. Oh, there's stuff down there. High rope. Wow, you're intimidating. Cool down, invite, heat up. Invite? Invite Pyro to hang out. Sorry, I'm all tied up. What the frick? Okay, you gotta go through the fires. Pretending to pull the... I didn't want to figure out how to beat him. Okay. On the left. Sure. I just went up to it to Timmy. No, I'm good. I don't need to go back here. Oh god. We're gonna go to the save point and heal again so I can heal myself for free. Which won't be difficult because it's right there. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, man. Oh boy. 
Oh no. It wouldn't let me escape. Because there's like two of them. No, come on. Let's freaking die. Oh well, I guess the save point's right there. Hurt. Yeah, yeah, a little bit. <laughs> well, can reassures you the plane turning tiny is like completely intent intentional. Oh, okay. More health again. Equip it just so I can have more HP. Uh, Here, I. The blue lasers won't hurt you if you don't move. Orange ones, um, you have to be moving, and they, um, they won't, um, move through those ones. Oh, bye. Okay, so that's. Oh my God, I did it. Cause I haven't shook like that since Undyne called me to ask about the weather. Oh. Wait, there's more weather down here. Why did she call me? And she has a crush on you. Oh shit. Oh, I gotta be moving. Okay, that's cool. Oh my god. Okay, I got this. Yeehaw, motherfucker. Cool. I don't have to worry about that anymore. Oh my god, I forgot to tell him where to go. <laughs> Cute pick of me right now. It's a photo of a garbage can with several pink glittery flitters over it. Okay. Uh, Alf is here. Um, the the northern door will stay locked until you solve the puzzles on the right and left. I, I think you should go to the right first. Thanks. Okay. The way to work is blocked, so I have time to catch a Metatron show on my phone. Amazing, the special effects are amazing today. The human almost looked real. Don't you recognize me? Metatron. Yeah, he's the most popular star in the underground. This fan club probably has at least two, no, three dozen members. Alright. Oh boy. wonder if I would, it would be fun if I explained the puzzle. Stop bothering me. The door le The door! What should his voice be? I don't know, the teeth made me want to do that. Shoot the opposing ship. Move the boxes to complete your mission. Okay. No. Alright. Wow, you solved it? I'm impressed. Well, you must be a total nerd. You must be a total nerd? I'm impressed. You must be a total nerd. I don't know. All right, let's go to the left now. No, I said left. 
Yeah, there we go. Help us here! Help us here! If that blue laser seems totally impossible, but I, as a real scientist, I have some tricks on my sleeve. I'll hack into the pop and dance the laser there and dig it out. Thanks. Finally, someone turned off that laser. Now, we're, now that we're free, we can. Well, uh, I guess we'll just keep standing here. We were hanging out when suddenly a bunch of puzzles reactivated out of nowhere. This is a huge problem. It, it rules. They've got to cancel school over this. Alrighty. I get two shots. I need two shots. Okay. Don't even ask me how I did that so easy so quick, because I was kind of winging it like, okay, this, 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 hey, I got it. Cool. Save point. Whatever, I'm going to play it. Uh, I think, um, hey, about the puzzles on the left and right. They're a bit too difficult to explain, but, uh, you already solved them? Awesome. Weren't you watching? I thought we were morphosing, morphosing this shit. Oh god, what's happening now? Hey, it's kind of dark in there, isn't it? Don't worry, we'll hack into the light system and brighten it up. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> oh yes! <laughs> Welcome, beauties, to the Underground's premier cooking show. Cooking with a killer robot. Preheat your ovens because we've got a very special recipe for you today. We're going to be making a cake. My lovely assistant here will gather the ingredients. Everyone give them a big hand. We'll need sugar, milk, and eggs. Go for it, sweetheart. You found the eggs. And the milk. And the sugar. MTT brand microwave, origin of the MTT challenge. Put your food in and set the microwave on high for five minutes. You can still recognize your meal, we'll double your money back. Oh yes, MTT brand ovens can reach temperatures up to 9,000 degrees. Roasting, toasting, burning, charring. You're excited, aren't you, darling? Yeah. Milk, eggs, in the fridge. No way, darling, they'd get cold. This isn't a show about washing your hands, darling. That's on Wednesdays. Perfect. Great job, beautiful. We've got all the ingredients we need to bake the cake. Milk, sugar, eggs. Oh my, what a magnificent moment. How could I forget? We're missing the most important ingredient. A human soul. Hello, I'm kind of in the middle of something here. Oh, wait a second. Couldn't you make a... Couldn't you use a... Couldn't you make a substitution in the recipe? A substitution? You mean use a different non-human ingredient? Why? Uh, what if someone's... Vegan? Vegan. Oh, well, that's a brilliant idea, Alphys. Actually, I had to have an opinion. I happen to have an option right here. MTT brand always convenient human soul flavor substitute. A can of which. It's just over on that counter. Well, darling, why don't you go get it? Oh, what the shit. By the way, our show runs on a strict schedule. If you can't get the can in the next minute, we'll just have to go back to the original plan, so better start climbing, beautiful. Oh no, there's not enough time to climb up. But fortunately, I might have a plan. When I was up here to the floor, I added a few features. You see that boat that says jetpack? Watch this. There. You should have just enough fuel to reach the top. Now get up there. Oh, what the frick is happening now? Uh huh. No, stop. I didn't sign up for this. This was not part of our agreement. Yes, it was. 
Sakamoto, you will not make it. Fuck your jetpack. How dare you. Oh no, I'm gonna get hit. Uh, wait, we're kind of gonna be there soon. Hopefully. Jesus. I promise I'm good at bullet hell stuff. Just good enough at least. My, my, it seems you bested me, but only because you had the help of the brilliant Dr. Alphys. Oh, I loathe what, I loathe to think of what would have happened to you without her. Well, toodles. Oh yes, about the substitution. Haven't you ever seen a cooking show before? I already baked the cake ahead of time, so forget it. Okay. Wow. Wow, we, we did it. We, we really did it. Great job out there, team. Oh, well, any, uh, anyway, let's keep heading forward. <sighs> that was stressful. What fun. Isn't that what, isn't that what video, the epitome of video games is? Sakamoto, yes. An ominous structure looms in the distance. You're filled with determination. Um... See? See that building in the distance? That's the core! The source of all power for the underground. It can reach geothermal energy into multiple energy by... Uh, anyway, that's where we're going to go. And the core is an elevator directly headed to our storage temple. And from there you can go home. Alright guys, I think I'm gonna end this episode here. Yeah. Find out next time on Dragon Ball Z with Sakamoto what happens in the next episode, because this episode is over now. And yeah, we'll see you next time. Hope you had fun watching me struggle against Metaton and whatever else we were just doing of you this time. Have a great!